After a couple of minutes, the machine will finish initializing and you'll be greeted by this screen on your display unit. It's telling us to turn on the power for the enclosure, so we're going to come down to our crash cart. It's hard to see in this, but it's down there is a power button. And now, this is a really neat feature, and hopefully you can see it in the video. It's telling us our LCD setup, so we can actually change what's on the LCD. Um, our server, so right now this is a picture of the front. It's telling us that none of the blades are on, but we can kind of go over them. We can also check out our enclosure, which gives us an inventory of what's on the back, with green indicating good, as well as amber indicating bad. And you have your blue and amber here. One of the great features about this enclosure is the remote management. If I can get back to that menu. So we're going to go to our IP summary. And I want my CMC IP address. So 192.168.040. For simplicity, I have this set up through DHCP. 